to add photos to your Google Drive and share for a photo blog. So you will go to google.com or Gmail. I'm going to make sure I'm signed into the account that I want. And then I look at this little nine or 12 dot area here. I think it's nine that would require counting. <laughs> Uh, and you choose Drive. Now I'm in my Google Drive. This is where I keep files. It's a very easy place to store photos. So I click on New and I'm going to create a folder. I'm going to call it Miami Wonders Tour 10 22. So this would be the name of the tour that you're going to send me photos for. And I create. So now it's in my drive. And I click on the actual folder, double click. It opens it up. It's empty right now. So I want to add photos. And I have the photos either in my photo area of my computer or in this case, I've created a file on my desktop with the photos I want to upload. So that's my empty file folder. Click on New, File Upload, and it pops open to Miami Wonders Tour. For me, it's just because I've run through this a few times, but it might open up your desktop or the last folder you've had open. And then I will highlight the ones I want so on a Mac, you would hold down the Command button and then just click on the ones you want. If you decide, oh, I don't want that one, you just Command, hold down the Command key and click again. But I want that one because it's Bob and Cindy. And then I open. And where these are opening is actually in the Google Drive in the folder that I've created. And then I wait for it to upload. It can take a little while if you don't have a fast Wi-Fi. We do. Uh, so it shows me four uploads are complete. I can X out of that. Now the next part is to share it with me. So I need to go back out to my drive, which is the general area. Go down and find my file folder called Miami Wonders. And now you see this little person up here? That's how you share. For me, uh, I want you to share it with Karen Cronister at Gmail. Dot com and that's it that's all you need to do I'll get a notice and then I'll accept it and I'll be able to access these photos